Well, without question, one of the most noteworthy characteristics of Wyoming, particularly western Wyoming, are big expanses of sagebrush. Before we settled the west, wildfires created mosaics in the sagebrush landscape. Now we fight fire, and most of the west sagebrush is old and decadent. It's less productive, diverse, or attractive to animals who rely on sagebrush. Sure, we burn, spray, chain, and beat brush, but we are behind nature's schedule. Plus, the objective is generally to get rid of all the brush, and that's not too desirable for the critters who rely on brush. A new sagebrush management technology is chemical thinning. You can see here that previously dense sagebrush has been thinned. Three or maybe four out of five sage plants have been killed. The water and nutrient resources previously consumed by that thick stand of sage are released to be used by other desirable plants. Cattlemen like to see more grass, and wildlife managers like to see more forbs in general productivity. It's a win-win situation for both livestock and wildlife managers, and it's certainly a boon to the ecologist who prizes a diverse ecosystem. It's a great tool to place in our bag of tricks for land management. From the University of Wyoming Cooperative Extension Service, I'm Eric Peterson.